In the Iowa language, ma means the earth. Ya means to lay out flat. So maya is the world, it's the earth, it's the landscape, it's lying out flat, the earth. Ha is your skin, that's the covering. The bark of a tree is naha, deerskin is taha. And so maha is the earth's skin, that's the soil. Mother earth is hina maya, the soil is her flesh. In our traditions, when our ancestors died, they went into the soil, but they also made the soil. The soil is that mother and child combined. It's what we come out of, it's what we go back to. And so we have that closeness to the soil because it is us. And when you're buried out in your family cemetery, you're part of that too now. So it's good to remember as you farm, there's thousands of years of my people, hundreds of years of yours, who are giving that life through your crops. If we look at our soils and where they came from, there are the glaciers. There's whatever came before the glaciers, which would have been bedrock of various kinds. The glaciers, when they were coming through, dropped an immense amount of um, rock mineral, um, parent material uh, that our soils are derived from. When the last glacier left at 12,000 years, it was muddy mess. And when it dried out and the wind blew, it blew this dirt, this lus, over and landed over here all over Iowa from a, a foot thick to 30 feet thick, depending upon where it is. Now Jefferson County was kind of flat. The high points across the county are all on the same level. But over time, erosion happened, and that's how we got the valleys and the creeks and the rivers. Valleys in the Midwest are filled with what's called alluvium. That is material that's washed downstream by the river. As the plants and animals colonize that loose geologic material, they actually create soil by putting organic matter into it. Those communities of bacteria and earthworms and fungi break it down through their digestive processes and make plant-available nutrients. Those organisms are critical for um, growing healthy plants. The really productive soils are very black. That black, rich black color is organic matter. The soils that are depleted or eroded are, are much lighter colored. That's why today's farmers often farm on those bottom lands because it is such fertile soil. 